You are now listening to 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Let's go! 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Now stepping into 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Yeah. Yeah, we Batman 15 MOFE. Uh oh, uh oh. Heavy bags. You gotta turn, turn that on, man. Turn that on. one, too. All right. Yeah. Let's make it hot, my nigga. You know. Heavy bag. Good to see you again, man. You too, man. I, right. gotta, I gotta tell you a story. You well, well, ha- hang on, can, can you not say that all that pioneer legend shit? Just, you know, no, star, no, no. star the nigga you love to I, hate. I, I'm, gonna right? tell, I'm gonna tell you a quick story, real quick. I, I was mad at you for a while. Okay, I was hating on you for a while. Let's, let's I, go, I, my you nigga. You were hating on me? Yeah. I knew it. And I said to Uncle Rai, he hating on us. I hate on everybody. You know huh? what I'm talking about, too, don't No, you? no, break it down. Break Yo, it down. Remember your QB bad in the city? QB from Bridgeport, Connecticut. Yes. Okay. The queen. You know what I'm saying? Um, I promoted a few battles with her. Which one are you talking Star about? Stargirl. Star Girl Lady Red. You show that woman some, some yeah, respect. Yeah. Star Girl Lady Red. Star Girl Lady Repping Red. Repping Mount Vernon. Yeah, and okay. I think you have 40 bars and somebody else. You don't fucking think. You know that was a classic battle. Yes. 40 bars versus Duchess. Duchess, yes. Yeah, it was okay. Duchess. What about it? I was busy with shit that day. Yeah, you know we Were you somebody outside with a fucking camera <laughs> and because I didn't stop to fucking talk to you, you nah, caught feelings? No, no, no. That wasn't what it was. Was one of your bitch ass friends no, caught no, no. feelings? No, we, no, no. We walked like seven blocks to get okay. to the event. We had like camera with us. And he was like, no cameras in the building. That's right. Yeah. We was paying and everything. <laughs> and I was like, this motherfucker, yeah, yeah. man. But you know what? I understand. You didn't know me at the time. But I just, you know, I felt like you shitted on me. And then you gave me, and then you didn't give me the interview. So I double shitted on me. But, you know, well, we, we made it happen. Well, first of all, good to see you again. <laughs> good to see you. <laughs> Thank you for the invite. Yes. I'm here in Bayonne, New Jersey. Yeah, my hometown. I haven't been in this shithole since <laughs> 1990. Yeah. Back when the Puerto Ricans would put your fucking vehicle up on cinder blocks. <laughs> yes. Within a matter of fucking minutes. Definitely. Okay. Uh, all right, so is, is that where you want to start? My, my event, uh, I think that may have been um, the big payback with QB versus Star Girl Lady Red. Mm-hmm. If you didn't holler at me prior to that event and then you came to that event wanting interviews and this and all that other dumb shit, yeah, man, more than likely I said, fuck you. <laughs> yeah, I'm a, cool. bus- I'm a businessman. Holler at me That's prior. Cool. I- I'm very accessible. I always have been. I talk that talk and I walk that walk. As you Definitely. can see, I'm just here with one homie. Yep. I got that wild thing on my waist, don't ever get it twisted. <laughs> Let's do it. But, um, no, that particular event was part of a battle rap media, you know, introduction into the world of battle rap that people needed to know about my promotion and marketing company. Yeah, but I couldn't allow cameras in that particular event because, you know, I, I have a deal with YouTube. Do you have a YouTube deal? Mm, not yet, but we're working on it. Okay. So, we're working so, on it. So he's trying to understand the business of, of <laughs> footage property and and all that sort of jazz but but yeah you know if, if you holler at me prior to an event and, and we don't even really do events uh, folks I'm talking about my company battle rap media we're a marketing and promotion firm um, you holler at me prior to that or any event that we do and that's what I'm here to talk about tonight is the upcoming battle rap convention yeah there is one going down yeah I'm behind it Wow can I get some fucking applause? Yeah. <laughs> Give him an applause, Leather Glove. What are you doing over there, man? What's his name? That's Leather Glove Dave. Leather Glove. Leather Glove Dave, yeah. okay? Yeah. Keep your finger on the fucking applause, homie. Tu hablas español. All night. Tu hablas español? Mucho poquito. Stop the applause. Stop the applause now. Mucho poquito. Mucho. Okay, you Latin King Papa? Nah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So, so what's going on, man? Um, no, we're here. You know, this is news to me. You know, about a convention. I think it's needed. You know what I mean? And explain exactly, you know, how far we're going with this. Like, it's other, very, other owners or... It's very much needed. I, I mean, I, I love what's going on with the culture of battle rap right now. And that's the hater mm-hmm. telling you he loves what's going on. Um, I have had a lifetime of success within the world of media and entertainment. I'm still eating off this, this you know, this, this game, lovely. Mm-hmm. Um... Back in 2009, my homie Street Star Norbs reached out to me and invited me to the first URL battle event. I hosted that event before before Smash started doing the brrrr. <laughs> I hosted that event. Um, T-Rex, Math Hoffa, uh, Young Miles, who's now known as Midwest Miles, and, and sadly uh, de- demolished Rich Dollars. 
Uh, and I think Cortez, and Cortez battled somebody, and Deacon Frost was there as well. So, so going back with the culture, you know, even far, even, even farther than that, than that, maybe a decade, I like where it's at. I think that a lot of you young people, and I say that respectfully, mm -hmm. are doing some of the things that is needed. You have a station here, and, and yes, I was hating on you, but, but, but not at that particular event. Okay. When you first came out the gate, I said, who is, who is this motherfucker? <laughs> He looks like he goggles cheeseburgers. Right. Round of applause, come on. Come on, stay with me. Stay with me, Porter Rock. Porter Rock. Okay, stop your applause. Stop your applause. But I was hating to see if you were going to be the most important thing needed, needed in this game, and that's consistent. Mm -hmm. And you are consistent, and I commend you for that, sir. Thank you. So okay. therefore, the hate has backed up. Okay. So when I see guys like yourself, uh, 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 Chris Unbias, who, who puts in the work, um, uh, 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 Angry Fan 007. Yes. Holy shit, can he talk? Round of applause. Yes. <laughs> that motherfucker. Letterman, too, man. Shout Letterman, man. All right, stop. Boom. <laughs> Three Letterman, his partner. Three That's Letterman is coming up. Don't, don't give him that much <laughs> That's fucking shot. my shot. man. Have you ever met him? Mm, not yet. Well, we, we're getting there. Okay. <laughs> we're we're going to talk some business and some bullshit because okay. there's a lot of motherfuckers running around claiming, yo, this is my nigga, that's my nigga. Okay. And if you haven't met somebody face to face, Slow down with that, yo, that's my nigga shit. Okay. Because there, there was a time when, you know, especially uh, uh, Dash Living's in the building where, you know, yes. where you had to test the motherfucker's hand skills to see if that was really your fucking guy. <laughs> Word. All right? Okay, so anyway, the, uh, the convention that we've been planning uh, since the winter, the brutal fucking winter that we had, myself and my Battle Rap Media partners, is just that, a convention where, where sponsors, potential advertisers come down. We're looking at September... October. I ideally, September would be the time, uh, and when I say a convention, for those of you young people who may not know what that is, that is a, a gathering, a business gathering. It's not a fucking nighttime event where, 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 where you know, music is blasting. Mm -hmm. It's in the daytime where you have panels, where you, where you may have workshops. Uh, I learned by way of, you know, people like Tom Silverman from Tommy Boy uh, Music, who, who, who still has the new music seminar. This is what I think, this is what I know will, will help the battle rap culture. Um, I am not one of the people who's now saying battle rap is too flooded. I'm not saying that there's too many leagues. I think that you know, if you guys want to start leagues, start leagues. I'm in battle rap as a businessman. You know, this this is America, land of capitalism. This is about some fucking paper, first and foremost. Okay. Eminem is a very credible source with regards to battle rap. Mm -hmm. He's been on the front lines of battling. So, so if you ask me, whatever he does by way of his company or his league, okay. I think people should give him the, the, the respect that it Definitely. truly, truly deserves. Uh, if, if, if they're talking about a committee to make certain decisions and rulings and so on and so forth, that's a good thing too. I'm simply talking about bringing in sponsors and advertisers uh, to, 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 to get behind some of the people such as T-Rex. You know, uh, Goods, Charlie Clips, who, who, who you know, I, I love Charlie Clips, and, and I shit on him because I love him. <laughs> um, Conceited, who's one of our best ever. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm simply trying, yeah, yeah. I'm simply trying to bring in, you know, sponsors. And, and, a, and a man of my age has to do just that in this particular culture. Anybody who's over 35 years of age who's not bringing money into battle rap, please tell them to get the fuck out. You are now. 15 minutes of fame radio. Let's go! 15 minutes of fame radio. Now stepping into 15 minutes of fame radio. That's my motherfucking jam right there.